Hi beautiful souls, welcome back to my channel wherever you are in the world today. It is a pleasure to have you here. First time viewers, my name is Kathy. I'm an intuitive holistic health coach, wellness mentor and spiritual guide and dropping in on this Friday beautiful souls with a really beautiful gorgeous gorgeous message for you all. Um, a little bit longer probably because it is a Friday. I definitely got a bonus angel guidance card at the end if you stick around. There's two of them today. Um, so again, beautiful souls, but beautiful, beautiful messages to end this week. And the first card out is number 18, and I'm smiling, the power of purpose. Now, we have talked about life purpose, life missions, all of those things, as I've said in so many videos, beautiful souls, for the last few weeks, especially those angel, pure angel messages, so much was coming up out of the collective about this is the time. I'm getting goosebumps as I talk about this. Now is the time. They're just saying bullseye. This arrow has hit the bullseye, beautiful souls. The power of purpose. When you are in your full divine purpose, beautiful souls, you are on target. You are on point. And they're just saying, like, you can see it's almost like um, uh, like spirit energy coming out of this arrow that's hit the bullseye, beautiful souls. And just, you know, again, you know, you've got these stars, like angelic energy, divine energy, beautiful souls. And they're just saying clock, like it's an old kind of clock. I don't know if you can see. You can't even really hardly read the numbers. But again, beautiful souls, right? The right time. Now is the time. Many of you have been in this holding pattern, this holding phase. But now is the time. Bullseye. God is about to launch you, beautiful souls, right? For many of you, we've been, they're just saying like an archer right where we've been under tension because we've been pulled right back and very shortly if you haven't already God is about to release you to hit the bullseye to be exactly where you need to be to be with the people that you need to be with or around beautiful souls to be doing and living and breathing what you are being put on earth to do at this time at this very time because it is a very significant time in humanity right and your clarifier beautiful souls is awesome is number 43 infinity unlimited potential so many of you right now could also be seeing the eights again 88 triple eight 88 88 beautiful souls right whatever that is for you and they're just saying again the arrow being drawn some of you might doodle I certainly do when I'm on the phone with people um, I'm drawing and Inna often talks about um, in her healing courses that um, we all come in with sacred symbols so for some of you you might even start to draw just go freehand beautiful souls this is a very specific message coming through for someone out there about sacred symbols about your your drawing something to do with what you do on pen and paper what you draw on pen and paper, beautiful souls. What, you know, just when you're freehand drawing, you're not really thinking about anything. What are the symbols and signs that you're drawing? Because for some of you, they are sacred symbols. For some of you, you might draw the eights. Some of you might actually draw your eights like that as well, beautiful souls, because they're just showing me the notepad, right? So again, Maybe writing down beautiful souls, unlimited potential, your dreams, goals, and desires, journaling at this time as well. But let's get into these messages. Final message for this week, beautiful souls coming in from the Oracle of Seven Energies. So for those of you that are wanting to know what this deck is, right? And they've got, they're got just saying the rainbow on the back. I believe the rainbow came out yesterday. I don't even notice it, but there you go. They've just drawn that to my attention. But beautiful souls, the power of purpose, individuation, 
seeing your unique place in the world. You are here for a reason, beautiful souls. There are no mistakes. It doesn't matter what you think you should be doing or what you're doing right now. You know, you could be at home. You could, you know, be like in the middle of nowhere and going, what is my purpose? Beautiful souls, if you're still drawing breath, God has not finished with you yet. A clear sense of authentic purpose, healthy self-esteem, beautiful souls, right? Maybe some of you have been working on your sacral and solar plexus over these last couple of months, beautiful souls. Letting go of conditioning, well, that's certainly been coming up over these past few weeks is letting go of old beliefs, old thought patterns, coulda, woulda, shouldas, didn'ts, the grief, the shame, the loss, the bitterness, you know, the resentment, all of those things, beautiful souls coming up for healing, letting go of conditioning, celebrating your uniqueness, you be you. Be you, beautiful souls. Everybody else is taken. Our fingerprints, right? The divine is within each and every one of us. Not one of us, 8 billion people on the planet have the same fingerprint. That is divine. That is God, beautiful souls, right? Again, orchestrating everything from start to finish, there comes a time when you realize that you are destined for something that is yours and yours alone. And this is you, beautiful souls. You are destined for something that is yours and yours alone. You are the one that God is going to draw that bow back on and send you forward. They're just saying propel you forward to the bullseye. There will be no mistakes. The catalyst might be an experience with a special person. Oh, my goodness, did connections and special people and love and all of that came out in yesterday's message. So beautiful new viewers, beautiful subscribers, if you haven't seen yesterday's message and this one resonates, there's most likely a message in the previous video. Go back and check it out. The catalyst might be an experience with a special someone, a path you choose or something that you just feel called to do. And this is the power they're saying. This is the frequency that many of you are feeling right now, the vibration, that little tap on the shoulder from your higher self, your guides and angels. You know you're here to do something and it will be different, beautiful souls, because you're doing it, right? You cannot fail. When you lead with your heart and you lead from source, God, infinite intelligence, you follow your divine blueprint. You'll discover it's not necessarily what you thought it would be. True. Many of you are going to end up being and doing things that are so far off what you currently do now or have been in the, have been doing in the past, beautiful souls. Like literally they're saying a complete 180. People are going to go, what? You're doing what? Yes, beautiful souls. And it has nothing to do with what everyone else wants or seems to want you to do. This is this conditioning, this societal conditioning and programming that we should grow up, you know, go to school, go to high school, university, whatever it is, get the degree, do this, buy the car, get the house, get married, have four kids. Whatever society says is the norm, beautiful souls, you're going to break a lot of that off, right? You're not, they're just saying you're not going to be bound by that conditioning any longer. An uncanny conviction takes hold from somewhere deep and true. At the core of your being, they're saying, beautiful souls, this divine spark, and I'm lighting up as I say this, is about to be set off. You feel a sense of power arising from a true sense of self. When you are good within yourself, beautiful souls, that energy just beams out of you. 
and I'm lighting up in goosebumps. But this is my confirmation for the beautiful new viewers. I call them truth bumps. This is my soul team activating me and just saying she's speaking the truth. I am connecting beautiful souls. These are the messages from the divine, from my beautiful guides and angels to you. Be you. When you are good within yourself, that energy is irreplaceable. It's insurmountable. It's it's irreplicable or whatever that word is, beautiful souls. People cannot replicate it. It's coming from you. It's coming from source. It's coming from you, beautiful souls, your uniqueness. That is you. You feel a sense of power arising from a true sense of self accompanied by a need for action. That's been many of us in this last season. Again, they're just saying like the bow being pulled back. We've been waiting and waiting and waiting. Come on, we want to hurry up. There's this sense of urgency with many of us out there now, the light workers, the empaths, you know, the galactics, all of you beautiful souls that are under the sound of my voice. You are feeling the need to activate, to take action, to do something. Now is the time. And they're just saying the time, right? You might feel as though time is running out to do the thing. A commitment to explore something or a purposeful choice. Right now, you're invited to step into a new empowered sense of authentic purpose. Not just any purpose, beautiful souls. Not just any career or entrepreneurship. Uh, an activated purpose, an authentic purpose. Because now you are coming from here beautiful souls, the core center of your being, you're being activated by the divine, right? Bolstered by a healthy dose of self-esteem. I talked about this before. I said, I felt as though some of you have really been working and up-leveling this saying, your solar plexus especially, right? Yellow may be very significant to you at this time. You're called to release your old conditioning, there's no need to be self-conscious or act a certain way to please others, which can sometimes take you in a direction that you don't want to go anyway. Oh, my goodness, beautiful souls. How many of you can put your hand up to that? Where in the past, you have suppressed your uniqueness, what you wanted to do to people please, to go with the flow, to go with the crowd to not stand out, beautiful souls, but to try to fit in. We are not here to fit in. We will never fit in, beautiful souls. We are not meant to. We are meant to be the mavericks at the front, right, bringing all of the people connected to us, behind us, with us, beautiful souls, activating them. As I've said so many times before, when you step into your purpose fully, you will activate and magnetize and attract all of your soul crew, your soul tribe to you, the people who have been waiting because they're waiting for you, beautiful souls, so they can be activated to do their thing, to help more people behind them. That is the effect. We are all connected. The discipline and will to evolve are yours by nature. So there's that free will that God gave us. Some of us beautiful souls have been treading water. Some of us have been a little bit unsure, uncertain. You know, you're going into the new um you know, you're just like, oh my goodness, can't I just stay in this comfort zone just a little bit longer because it's a little bit, it feels a little bit scary out there. Beautiful souls, if you're leading with your heart, if you're leading and following the guidance that your guides and your angels are giving you at this time, you cannot go wrong. You cannot fail if you immerse yourself fully in what is in front of you right now. Cannot make this up. You are exactly where you are meant to be. You are exactly where you are meant to be, beautiful souls, and you cannot fail. You never have to seek your purpose or wonder what it is. 
just keep removing the blocks to your essential self and your purpose will find you. It's that easy. What a wonderful thing to know. Many of you beautiful souls, your purpose will find you when you start to take off all of these layers that have been built around you, whether that's through ancestors, whether that's been through family conditioning, whether that's been through life conditioning, past life conditioning, beautiful souls, breaking off all of this old stuff, getting to the core of who you really are, beautiful souls. That's why it's lit up, literally. They're just saying like gold dust, like gold magic. And, you know, again, you've got your soul team, beautiful souls, right there with you. It's a bullseye. You cannot fail, right? So for some of you, you need to hear that. No matter what the steps might look like in front of you right now, and they could just be baby steps, beautiful souls, right? But each step forward, right, again, is progressing you along the path. And in, as I've said in other videos, in 365 days from now, you can look back and see how far you've come, how far you've come in a week, how far you've come in a month, three months, six months, 12 months. Just do something each day, beautiful souls, that keeps the needle moving forward. Infinity, unlimited potential. What a beautiful card. As I said, the eights, very significant. The infinity symbol, also known as a lemniscuit, is a symbol that literally has no end. You can't pinpoint where it ends or it begins, but it still continues the possibilities are endless. And when you step into your purpose fully, beautiful souls, right, the possibilities will be endless because there will be so many things, opportunities, people, whatever it's been attracted to you. It will be magnetized, they're saying to you. It will be pulled into your vortex. Dream big. Set challenging goals. That's probably going to scare a few of you, right? Dream big, beautiful souls. God knows you need all the normal stuff, the home, the, you know, pay the rent, the food, the kids, the whatever else it's been. He knows all of that. You will always have your needs met. But what do you want, beautiful souls? What's the big stuff, right? The vision board that you've got. What's on there? What's, what's up here? What are the dreams? What are the visions that you're getting, right, that you're thinking about in the back of your mind? Some of you might think they are just way past what could ever possibly happen in my life. Beautiful souls, if you're thinking it, you're dreaming it, you're envisaging it, it's on a dream board, it's on a vision board, it's in your God-ordained set blueprint, it will happen. But you also have to help God and help your angels by taking these steps as well. Breaking through barriers, real or imagined, because many of us beautiful souls, those barriers are, uh, uh, are imagined. They're not real. There's things that we've made up, the programming, remember? The old conditioning, the past life stuff, the childhood stuff, beautiful souls, that's kept us subconsciously and unconsciously on this loop. Anything is possible, so release any self-imposed limitations. If you are doubting your own ability, oh my goodness, now it's time to believe in your potential. The lemniscate can also signify that you are on to something bigger than you can ever imagine. Some of you, these little beginnings these little ideas, whatever it's been that you're being downloaded with or working on at this time, beautiful souls, whatever that is, right, that nothing is insignificant. But again, some of you, it's going to be big. It's going to be big, beautiful souls. Whatever ideas you have now can grow exponentially. This card is also a reminder to resist settling for less right? The infinity sign, beautiful souls, has no ending. There are no limits. 
the ceiling they're saying, right? So a lot of us have these unconscious blocks as well as to how high we can elevate, how high we can go in our careers or our money, what we can make, beautiful souls. We've got these defaults that have been playing in the background. Now it is time, beautiful souls, to be to be working on those, releasing those, pushing through those limits and those barriers, doing the healing, because what is coming came up in yesterday's card. Better days are ahead. This card is also a reminder to resist settling for less. It might appear easier, but you are destined for more. Keep going. Keep going, beautiful souls. It comes up so many times because many of you need to hear these messages frequently. Additional meanings, multiple possibilities. So I said before, beautiful souls, when you hit that bullseye, as you progress to the target, which is your life purpose, you are going to start to pull into your field all of these other possibilities, all of these other connections, all of these other resources, things that you could only have ever imagined. Avoid self-sabotage. What, what was I just saying before about limiting beliefs and putting a, that unconscious block, right, or that ceiling, that cap, beautiful souls on things. It is time to expand an ongoing situation, beautiful souls. I feel for many of you, what a way to end this week infinite possibilities, bullseye, life purpose, life mission. Many of you are about to hit the target. Many of you are in the resistance phase, beautiful souls, the tension phase, and you're about to be let go, right? Infinite possibilities coming in, better days ahead. Dream big. Let go of self-imposed limitations. You are God's spark at your source, right? At your, at your core level. And your two little bonus um, angel guidance cards, beautiful souls. The first one, here's that pink energy, pink and lavender, release and surrender. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. This came up in yesterday's message, all about love, beautiful souls. Pink, open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Some of you beautiful souls, right? You've got your hands closed. How are you going to release yourself if you're holding on to something else? God is saying, your angels are saying, let go. Open your hands, your arms and heart to our love and assistance. Remember, I always say, don't ask, don't get. Your angels and guides are there. You just have to ask them, beautiful souls. It is free will, right? They Otherwise, they have to stand back until you say, please intervene. Please bring me. I need help with. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. We open your arms, sorry, open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands, your arms and heart to our love and assistance. And your second bonus one, beautiful souls, I cannot make this up, perfect timing. Perfect timing, beautiful souls. Perfect timing, right? Perfect timing. Even with the clock they're saying there, this funny, it's like an old ancient clock of some description. Now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations. Oh my gosh, was that not all coming up in this card? The doors are open while you walk through them with us by your side. You're never alone, beautiful souls. Don't delay or procrastinate as all of the ingredients are ripe for success. Everything and everyone is on your side supporting your positive outcome. 
Oh my goodness, beautiful souls. Green energy, healing energy. This is what I was saying before. Green and gold, beautiful souls. Beautiful, beautiful colors. Green is healing, heart chakra healing. I've said that before and they're just saying as I said that, there's a tiny little heart right on her chest. She's blowing this trumpet. Growth, they're saying. All these leaves coming out of her trumpet, beautiful souls. This is growth. Your next season, this season is growth. Harmony, they're saying. The music symbols, right? Harmony, beautiful souls. Peace and harmony. Perfect timing. Now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations. The doors are open while you walk through them with us by your side. Don't delay, don't procrastinate as all of the ingredients are ripe for your success. Everything and everyone is on your side supporting your positive outcomes. Beautiful souls, what gorgeous messages. They're just saying the pink in that as well. To end this week, to go into this week, end beautiful souls, right? Right? Oh my goodness me, claim it, believe it, receive it. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what is going on because now is the time, as I said, beautiful souls, now is the time. Many of you, you have been in that phase where God has had you pulled back. You've been under tension. You've been raring to go, wanting to go, hurry up and go. Let's move things forward. Others of you may be feeling a little bit fearful, beautiful souls, because when you get launched, you're going to go at speed right at that target, right? There's no mistakes. It's all going to happen in divine set timing. But amazing things are coming in. Claim it, believe it, receive it, beautiful souls. I send you all so much love. Go have the most beautiful, blessed, amazing weekend. And, of course, I will see you in here for the next one. Bye for now.